next level. Lester Longley was involved in breaking up a Guadeloupe move, and when the ball found its way back to him, his neat one-two with Malcolm LeBlanc set up a fierce shot from 35 yards. After that, Guadeloupe continued to show the more creative football. Dominique Mocha and Constant Theracine combining nicely down the left-hand side, even if Mocha's eventual shot was slightly less impressive. But it was Mocha who continued to look dangerous. His sharp turn and shot in the second half from Laurent's layoff left Clemson Prince furious at his defence. But there was nothing any of them could do about Mocha's shot in the final minute of the match. It was an attack created out of nothing from the back of defence. Five passes were all it took for the ball to reach Mocha. He laid it off to Lambord, and when the big man returned it to him, his volley on the turn left the unfortunate Prince grasping at thin air. It was Guadeloupe's second spectacular strike in as many games, and the second time they'd kept their fans waiting until the final minutes to secure the points.